Hey, what's up guys, Faisal here with another cool video on the channel Billion Dollar iTech. Today's video is a bit different. We are recording Outstation. Today's topic is about top 20 MacBook keyboard shortcuts that I use very frequently. If you're interested, stay tuned and let's get started. Number 20. Cut and paste files. Well, most of us know already. Command C and then Command V to copy and paste files. But the problem is, it will just duplicate the file. What if you want to cut and paste it rather than have many duplicate files? Well, simply press Command C to copy any file and then you can go to any destination folder and press option plus command and press V. It will actually move the original file to new destination. Number 19. Screenshot Shortcuts There are five different types of keyboard shortcuts to take different screenshots. Capture the old screen and the immediate screenshot will be placed on your desktop in a very convenient PNG file. All you have to do is anywhere on your screen press command shift and 3. Now let's say you want more precise selection. All you have to do is press command shift 4 and you will notice the cursor will turn into a plus sign which allows you a very precise selection of what you want to screenshot and then it will appear on your desktop in a PNG file. Did you also know that to take a screenshot of an app window just press command shift 4 space and click on app window. Also to take a screenshot of window without shadows around it press command shift 4 space once you got the camera icon press an old option key when you take the screenshot now what if you want to straight away copy the screenshot on your clipboard to copy the screenshot on your clipboard simply press command shift 4 space once you got the camera icon press and hold control key when you take the screenshot and you can paste it anywhere number 18 launch Siri I personally use Siri a lot Siri is more responsive and smarter than ever before she can be launched in many ways you can launch Siri by clicking on menu bar icon but you can use keyboard shortcuts to do it easy way by simply press command space almost same time you can also change the keyboard shortcut by going to system preferences Siri and keyboard shortcuts number 17 sleep mode to lock max screen quick when you got work out of sudden one of the easy way to put your Mac on sleep mode from your keyboard press command option power button immediately your Mac will go to sleep mode number 16 I apps doing something at work you shouldn't be when your boss walks by there's an easy fix though to hit command H on your keyboard to hide current active app if you just need to declutter your view press command option H will hide all other apps in the background letting you focus on one in front number 15 quick scroll to scroll up and down on your page of Safari or Chrome just press 
function up or down arrow key you can scroll quicker or if you want to scroll to the top or bottom of the page just press command up or down arrow key it's very simple and easy number 14 force quit if an application has annoyingly logged up and all you get is dreaded spinning ball when you mouse over it simply press command option skip use the shortcut to bring up the force quit dialog this will then enable you to stop the application. If you don't want the force quit dialog, just press skip. Number 13. Text, copy, cut, paste, reformat. Text copying, cut and pasting is much quicker if you master the keyboard shortcuts. But always look out for a paste and match style if you are copying text from a color website. Press Shift Option Command V so you don't have to reformat text to match its destination. Number 12. Move app in background. It's annoying sometimes when you want to move some apps in the background, but it turns up covering your focus window. To move the window in background, simply press and Alt Command and you can move any window in background it's easy number 11 empty trash if you're a designer or a heavy user like me that downloads lot of files and at the end of the day delete all unnecessary files well every time when we delete files they move to trash and then you delete them from there empty trash from keyboard faster press shift command and delete number 10 special characters to open special characters on your Mac press command control and space there you have variety of options to select of your favorite emojis number 9 picture slideshow you might be annoyed to open each picture on your Mac one by one. Well, there is an easy solution for slideshow. Simply select the photos and press Command, Option and Y. The slideshow begins. By viewing the slideshow, you can skip ahead or pause as you wish. Number 8. Move forward or backwards. By pressing Command and the left bracket you can move previous folder or by pressing command and right bracket you can move to the next folder and it's very convenient number seven undo or redo I guess most of you know to undo you can just simply press command Z while fairly common this shortcut is an important one. Use this to undo the previous action. Now, what happens if you undo more than what you wanted? Well, this shortcut operates as a redo functionality. To put back the last change that was undone with an undo function. Just press Command Shift Z to redo it. Number 6. Direct to a specific folder. Imagine you are a person who organizes the work lot and on your Mac Finder you have hundreds of folders. To find a specific folder what you are looking for could be a problem. The easy solution is when you have a Finder open use this shortcut Command Shift G open a direct line to a specific folder simply put the folder path in the space that appears or even you can put only the first word and it will take you directly to the folder number five close window or reopen close tab 
to close an active tab on Safari or Chrome using the keyboard simply enter command W. In fact you will find it works nearly every application on Mac or if you reopen any tab that was recently closed press command shift and T it will reopen the tab number four hide or unhide the dog how often have you wanted to get rid of the dog so you can give yourself more room on your screen but didn't want it to go through all the menu options to hide it if you press command option D this shortcut will help you to hide and unhide the dog number three zoom in and out this function will need to be enabled in the universal access pane in system preferences first but once it's activated it will enable you to zoom in or out of the screen if you press command option plus or minus sign on your keyboard this will zoom in or out of the screen and you can then move the mouse to easily paint or on the page number two word or sentence selection if you are an academic writer blogger or a student and you spend most of your time writing articles notes and assignments this keyboard shortcut will save a lot of your time if you have multiple lines and you just want to copy half of the sentence just simply press option shift and left and right arrow key depends on which side of the word or line you want to select or if you want to select the whole paragraph just press option shift and up and down arrow key depends if you are at the beginning or end of the paragraph number one finder shortcuts for desktop folder hit command shift D will quickly open desktop folder for downloads hit option command L to view downloaded files for documents press command shift O for quick airdrop shortcut press command shift R to open utilities hit command shift U will open the utilities folder these are the top 20 shortcuts of macbook they are really useful and i use them very frequent the urdu version of this video please click here if you find this video informative please like and subscribe to our channel the full article of this video the link is in the description please follow us on instagram and like our page on facebook until then peace